anxious Sox fans are hoping for a lot of air traffic. Baseballs, kind of, we're talking about here, flying out of guaranteed rate field today. Yeah, it's the home opener. Expectations high this year. Jake is live. He is on the field. Good morning to you. Good morning, guys. Yeah, it is an absolutely gorgeous morning out here, and it's always such a cool thing whenever we come out and cover home openers and opening day because there's a stretch where we're some of the few people on the – how many people actually get to sort of be out here and basically have the entire field, the entire stadium to themselves? i got to be honest, it's not going to look like this in a couple of hours. First pitch at 310. This place is going to be packed. It is going to be electric, and it is going to be full of fans ready for a big win. You know – other than, than coming out and, and, and doing great things on the field, the Sox are doing great things with their charities. And here to talk to me about that is Christine O'Reilly. But I was talking to Christine a couple of minutes before we went live, and I kept noticing this, this glimmer kept shining into my eyes. And I, and I was wondering, what, look, look, what is this piece of jewelry you've got right now? I'm hoping for another one. That's the 05 World Series ring. Um, I proudly wear it. Great I memory. would wear that every day. I know you probably wear it on opening days at home. I would never take that thing off. That's gorgeous. Pretty but special. I want to talk about all the great things you guys do. The raffle raised so much money. And obviously there's a very important cause that you guys are celebrating and, and really helping out with this year. So tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, so every day, every home day, we have our sock split, which is the classic 50-50 raffle. Fans buy raffle tickets in the, until the seventh inning of the game. We draw a lucky winner. White Sox Charities gets half the proceeds, and some lucky fan goes home with half the proceeds. Last year's opening day winner took home almost $100,000. So and We were talking about this in the break. Statistically speaking, compared to like the lottery, you have a much better chance at winning this. It's great odds. It's great odds for our fans. And it's, you know, really, White Sox Charities is powered by the generosity of our fans. We're so thankful to them. But we're doing something special today. First of all, we seeded the jackpot. So even if we only sold one raffle ticket, the winner's going to take home minimally $25,000. But we hope to blow that total out of the water because today's opening day proceeds are going to benefit two amazing organizations, UNICEF and World Central Kitchen, specifically to support their their aid that they're providing for kids and families in the Ukraine and those who are displaced from the Ukraine. Absolutely love that. So you come out, you grab a beer, you grab a dog, and then you can also go home feeling good about yourself. Like you, you made a difference. Like, like whether you win or not, let's be honest, you're just helping somebody out. Isn't that what matters? That, that is what matters. So grab a beer, grab a dog, grab a sock split raffle ticket. If you're here at the ballpark, we'll have sellers all over the ballpark. But fans can get a raffle ticket right now. They're on sale online. White Sox. Don't even have to be at the game. Don't have to be at the game. WhiteSox.com slash Sox Split. We sell them till the seventh inning. So, again, just a great way to be a part of the excitement for opening day. And who knows? Maybe go home with a cash prize. Love that. Christine O'Reilly, I always love talking with you because it means it's time for baseball and it's time to do some good. Seriously, happy home opener, and, and we'll see you soon. Sounds great. Thanks. All right, guys. We're going to be live out here for the rest of the morning here on Good Day. It's gorgeous. I mean, look at this. I'm gonna, I got to step off the shot. Look at the sun bathing over the grass. Look, you got the home open. You got the opening day signs. It's just, I mean, you couldn't have asked for anything better. I've, I've done my fair share of these, and I'm, I'm embracing and I'm enjoying every second because I know next year it might not be the same thing. Yeah. So uh, on, on, on that note, <laughs> I'm going to send it back to you guys in the studio. Yeah, I'm going to see if they'll let me run on the Can I run on the No, I can't, no, I can't run on the field. Better don't not run the field. Don't touch the grass. Come don't, on, Jake. Don't touch